division. Now the quarterfinals roll along, more heavyweight throwdowns. It's nightmare and biohazard. Bill, what can you tell us? Let's dip into my septic tank of knowledge. Sean, these are two veteran battle bots, both to be feared and respected. Builder Jim Smentowski won the lightweight division last season with Backlash, the mini-me version of Nightmare. The spinning disc of doom can inflict punishment, but his wheels are very vulnerable. Biohazard comes to us from Carlo Bertacchini. Last season, Biohazard didn't make it to the finals. That lifting arm can come out of nowhere and change Biohazard's luck. Hey, Mouser Mecha Catbot, beware. There's a new killer kitty marking his territory inside the battle box. All right, they're about ready to go at it. Let's get down to the floor. Contest. Introducing in the red square, you are about to witness the most destructive and violent carnage in robot fighting. If that's what you came here for, put your hands together for Nightmare! And in the blue square, opponents will find no safe place to dispose of this toxic demon. Generations of robots to come will pay the price for exposure to bio. Take a look at Jim Smithowski. Looks pretty confident. Wouldn't be surprised to see him draw first blood with that. He's going to have to move fast because Biohazard, very fast, speedy. Carlo Bertacchini, great driver. Box is locked. The lights are on. It's robot fighting time. It's Biohazard. The sleek low to the ground. And Nightmare. There you see Nightmare right now using that spinning wheel of death to score points on Biohazard. The sparks were flying. He got in a nice pop on Biohazard's titanium fender. Biohazard almost oh, took Nightmare man. over, and another blow, and something came out of Biohazard. That spinning wheel of death is inflicting punishment on Biohazard early in this fight. Take a look at the titanium fender of Biohazard. You can see it. It's off the ground. He's got some marks on him from Nightmare. You see Biohazard trying to get underneath and flip him over. Two good drivers. Oh, the kill soft now working the advantage of Biohazard. And what's wrong with that wheel, Bill? It takes a while for it to get going. You can see it's moving. Now it's being pounded by the pulverizer. There you see the operator of the pulverizers, and they're scoring points on Nightmare by the second here. Now he wants to bring the arm down because the pulverizer's not hitting as hard. What does he do here? He's got a problem, decision to make. Bring the arm down and let Nightmare go or keep him up there. He brought him down and it doesn't look like Nightmare spinning Neil of Death is spinning at all. Points being scored as we sit here and watch and it looks to be something wrong with Smentowski as he's got the countdown. Nightmare's got a Lexan shield over his electronics, got knocked down into his controller. That's it. Oh, oh man. You know what? We have a great fight going on. Loses control. And actually, at that point, before the pulverizers kicked in, take a look at the highlights. Nightmare was winning this oh, fight. Look at that. Short and sweet sparks flying. Biohazard not dying, though. Instead, drives Nightmare into the pulverizer. And that's where Nightmare gets ambushed. Let's go to Mark Bureau. By knockout in the blue square. Biohazard's moving on to the semifinals with major authority. And when we come back, we'll have the battle stats and the hit of the week. Welcome back to BattleBots, everyone. Bill, take us through those battle stats. Glad to. That was a close fight at the start. Biohazard led in hits 5-3, to three, while Nightmare led in weapons damage 2-0. Ah, but that pulverizer banged on Nightmare like a tin drum. Hazard damage goes to Biohazard. 28 to nothing. Let's go check in with the combatant. Tyler, you won the match, but you took some hits. How is that gonna affect you as you move forward? Yeah, I had to pay for that win there. Got a couple of good gashes here. Uh, I'm gonna find a big hammer, maybe Mahler's hammer, and uh, pound on it a little bit, see if I can straighten it out. I've got some spare parts. Maybe we can get this back uh, in decent shape for the next match. So it seemed like you guys were going toe to toe for a little while, and then it seemed like he just pulled out a kind of good old fashioned butt whipping on well, you. Oh, <laughs> yeah, he's got a lot of power and a lot of pushing and lifting power, and uh, I got a couple of good hits on him, and it looked great, and I had a lot of fun, and I'm honored to have lost to Biohazard. 